Story Number Fifty Three, Jephthah's Promise. Have you ever made a promise and later found it hard to keep? The man in this picture did, and that is why he is so sad. The man is a black judge of Israel named Jephthah. Jephthah lives at a time when the Israelites are no longer worshiping Jehovah. They are again doing what is bad. So Jehovah lets the people of Ammon hurt them. This makes the Israelites cry out to Jehovah, "We have sinned against you. Please save us." The people are sorry for the bad things that they have done. They show that they are sorry by worshiping Jehovah again, and so again Jehovah helps them. Jephthah is chosen by the people to fight against the bad Ammonites. Chapter wants very much for Jehovah to help him in the fight, so he promises Jehovah, "If you will give me victory over the Ammonites, the first person that comes out of my house to meet me when I return from the victory, I will give it to you." Jehovah listens to Jephthah's promise, and he helps him to win the victory. When Jephthah returns home, do you know? Who the first one is to come out to meet him? It is his daughter, who is his only child. Oh, my daughter, Jephthah cries, "What a sadness you are bringing me!" But I have made a promise to Jehovah, and I can't take it back. When Jephthah's daughter learns about his promise at first, she is sad too. For it means that she will have to leave her father and friends, but she will spend the rest of her life serving Jehovah at his tabernacle in Shiloh. So she tells her father, "If you have made a promise to Jehovah, you must keep it." So Jephthah's daughter goes to Shiloh, and she spends the rest of her life serving Jehovah at his tabernacle. Four days out of every year, the women of Israel go to visit her there, and they have a happy time together. The people love Jephthah's daughter because she is such a good servant of Jehovah.